But play, uh, to be true play, means that all your energy is focused on what you're doing. And there's no uh, uh, divided uh, concentration isn't play. Uh, so, um, sort of uh, an expectation of that you'll become a great athlete and win a $40 million contract, uh, that, wouldn't, that wouldn't be uh, helpful to play. <laughs> and uh, but, but being worried about what other people think of you or how well you're going to do, uh, self-censoring is one of the biggest hindrances to play. Uh, because all of a sudden you're divided and you can't give yourself wholly, wholly to the experience. And so people, when they play, they're uh, uh, at the peak of their uh, uh, mental and, and physical abilities uh, because they are, are, are totally committed. And so why people, this is where why people feel a sense of exhilaration in play uh, because they're completely integrated and they just feel this sense of incredible wholeness uh, because that is the only thing going on is that joy of the experience and the qualities of deep play are uh, a diminished sense of self and uh, uh, being totally uh, immersed in the focus of play and also in the present moment and uh, uh, there, there's a bunch of other ones too, but a sense of timelessness, and you could say a peak experience or being in the zone, uh, a flow experience. It's all similar. It has all these qualities, and there's no sense of uh, ego uh, involved. It always seems to mess up the works, uh, and so um, it, it, you know. And through deep play, people are totally absorbed in the experience. And so if we're trying to help people feel uh, being a part of nature or a part of anything else, um, uh, play can be an incredible ally because it, it helps people to feel immersed in the object of play. And if the object of play is nature, uh, then, you know, if it's a tree or a hillside, a, a field of flowers with uh, bumblebees, uh, then, um, if you're immersed in that experience, you're having that, uh, you know, that, that sense of communion with nature. Uh, and so, it, it just seamlessly transfers, of course, over to that. And, and that's uh, why play is uh, so, so important. And what is the difference between regular play and uh, deep play? It's simply a matter of degrees in terms of how absorbed are you in the experience. Um, you know, the, the scientists uh, in using the mind will stand back and observe, but there's a distance uh, uh, from the experience. Uh, but uh, a young child will just jump in feet first into the experience. Uh, but uh, all the great scientists, they do the same. Uh, and that's why they're successful.